गुड मॉर्निंग एन इंटरेस्टिंग केस केस ला वेरी सेक्शन फिफ्टी वन ऑफ द ट्रांसफर ऑफ प्रॉपर्टी एक्ट इन्वॉल्व हियर एक्चुअली व्हाट एड एपन द डिफेंडेंट अपार्ट फ्रॉम हिज प्रॉपर्टी ही एनेक्स्ड सम neighboring property belonging to the plaintiff and they extended his construction therefore the plaintiff filed a suit for possession and prohibitory injunction the lower court decreed the suit but appellate court uh, confirmed the judgment but varied the degree stating that uh, instead of uh, demolition and uh, demolition of structures compensation was assessed for payment so against that uh, second appeal was filed uh, uh, review was filed then supreme court dealt the matter and finally delivered the judgment on 2223 very very important aspect uh, because uh, all uh, we must understand uh, how oh, uh, this case uh, uh, civil suit of 1988 that is unfortunate finally it was decreed the they say what is section 51 when the transfer of immovable property makes any improvement on the property believing it good faith that he is absolutely entitled there to, and he is subsequently evicted there from any person having better title the transfer has a right to require the person Causing the eviction either to have the value of improvement estimated and paid or secured to transfer, or to sell his interest in the property to the transferee at the then market value thereof, irrespective of value of such improvement, amount to be paid or incurred in respect of which shall be estimated value thereof at the time of eviction. When the uh, under the sake of the transferee has planted or sown the property crop which are growing, when he is there, he is entitled to such crop and to pre ingress egress. to gather and carry them this is what section 51 transfer of property act says but uh, the ratio of the supreme court was here the concept of uh, accusations concept of title by accusations uh, this is this is what this uh, the the supreme court held that uh, it was the burden of the defendant to establish the plaintiff had accused infringement of his legal right and allowed unauthorized construction in the absence of any title over the suit land defendant could not have claimed bona fide of his action in carrying on construction therefore they say they are directed the defendant to hand over the possession of the demolished building constructed and uh, hand over this so the supreme court had deeply discussed about the entire uh, section 34 38 and uh, 115 of evidence act and uh, this 51 of the transfer of property act all these provisions are much important they held the dependent not entitled to benefit under section 51 transfer of property act available to bona fide holder making improvement under defective title so this is what uh, you have to prove and further the def- the defendant fails to uh, counter claim that he is entitled for uh, continuation of possession by title by adverse possession this is what all happens we should be very alert in defending as well as filing suit best wishes